Hi, everyone. Mariam and I are here for day, what are we now? Day five? Day five of our 33 days of manifestation. Yes. <laughs> it is. It is. <laughs> and uh, Mariam's going to lead today. But before she starts, I just want to tell you, I got my Aurora Borealis last night. It was Ooh. magnificent. I'll post, uh, I'm making a little movie of some pictures that I'll post um, right after this. So I'll also post it in the comments. And um, I hope you guys are manifesting some fun things. Remember this week, we're just keeping it light and fun. This is the opening up exercise. Oh, so, that's here we go. Bonita. I can't wait to see your post. Yay. <laughs> I'm going to manifest watching that with you sometime. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> that's and there were shooting like, stars. Aurora Borealis. Aurora Borealis, crystal clear night. Like you can see billions of stars, oh, and wow. there were shooting stars. It was Amazing. awesome. Did you make wishes? Always. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's so fun. So speaking of the manifestation and fun, um, the other day when you and I were talking and you mentioned that you had asked for like little unicorns and uh, mm -hmm. horses of any kind, magical horses and all that, I really liked the idea and I thought, okay, I'm also, since you know me, I like magical stuff as well. And Definitely like unicorns. I figured, okay, let me add the dragons to it. And um, anyone who knows me, you would know that I love dragons. So I decided that's what I want to manifest for the day. Dragons <laughs> in any way that's possible. So um, did my little visualization and all the things that we're telling you guys just did that and I left it open and actually I've asked for that for the whole week so I started seeing phrases about dragons you know like pictures about dragons they're coming they're coming every day <laughs> which is really exciting and um I mean, this doesn't particularly like necessarily include this, but I have a dragon that shows up in my meditation every single Wednesday now for quite a while. And he just popped in one day and decided to accompany me. <laughs> so he came really strong yesterday telling me, didn't you want me to be here? So I'm like, of course. <laughs> so I'm, I'm getting dragons so far. We'll awesome. see how yeah yeah very fun but that definitely puts a smile on my face because you know you want to visualize something that's fun for you and that's how it works guys <laughs> just put put yourself in touch with that joyous vibration and visualize <laughs> yeah um and Tomorrow, you guys, we're going to do an exercise on manifesting inspiration. Whatever you're, whatever you're working on today, tomorrow, we're going to start opening up our hearts to things that inspire us or the like. So as you're working today, just think about inspiration is coming. Yes. yes. Actually, if you don't mind, Bonita, I can... Um, just a very, very short little meditation. Mm -hmm. um, I can mention it's like, it's just going to be a couple of minutes, but that's really Excellent. all you need to just get yourselves going for manifestation. And um, why don't we just go ahead and, and start everybody, wherever you are, make yourselves comfortable and close your eyes. Close your eyes and take a few slow breaths. Emphasizing the out breath being longer and slower than the in breath.
taking another breath. You can count. You can go count of five. Take your breath in. And exhale to the count of seven. Now, use your imagination. Imagination is no different than visualization for something specific. Use your imagination and focus on what you would like to have realized. And really, really feel the feelings. This is very important. Feel the feelings. Imagine it having happened already. And you are experiencing it, whatever it is. Get into that vibration. Once you have a very crystal clear picture of it, or feel the feelings, however you sense things, give gratitude and thank the universe for making it happen, for helping you co-create this with the universe. Are you feeling, sensing, seeing? When you are ready, once you are totally immersed in this sensation, you can open your eyes. So it's okay to use the mental mind in order to create the images that we want. That's a co-creation with the universe. We have the mind and the heart working together, aligning together for the purpose of bringing forth something we want. And that's what that's what manifestation is, really. <laughs> That's beautiful, Mariam. Thanks. Thank you. So before we sign off today, um, just remember, sitting and manifesting without action is not as effective as taking the actions forward going forward with the vision, with the manifestation. It also really helps those who are helping you to bring what you need, your next step forward in your path. So when you're trying to manifest, when you are manifesting, you may get messages, do this, do that. It's quite appropriate for you to talk with them and, you know, say what happens if I do this, should I do this? Or, you know, to chat with them, but go forward. Make sure you are going forward, bringing action to your vision. Right, right. That's really with, good reminder, Bonita. It's important. Yeah. And that's part of why we want to do it right now with things that are really not important to you because you're learning to communicate with them. And if you're doing something that's important to you and your communication skills are not as sharp as they will be, the action you take may not have the actual effect you're looking for. So now as we're neutral and joyous and it's things that like, if it works, it doesn't work, you know, it's no big shakes in your actual life. You are also learning to communicate, to receive and to go forward. 
Exactly. To recognize when you get guidance, what it is. Mm -hmm. Don't yes. start judging it and labeling it. Oh no, I've cracked, you know, I'm hallucinating or whatever. No, <laughs> you're not. <laughs> you're being guided. Yeah. <laughs> Learn yeah. to trust that. So you start with something small and once you notice one thing, the next one will come. Right. So now with these little things that are not that important, you're learning, you're learning to communicate, you're developing your skills, you're learning the manifestation language, you're learning, you know, you're opening with your guides. So there's no pressure on, oh, yeah, I thought you meant this, let me pull back. Oh, let's try that pull back. Oh, you know, so that as we go forward, so inspire, manifest, communicate, connect, receive and go forward and see where it takes you. Excellent. Yeah. Well, have a wonderful have day, it. everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye. Here, me. Oh, there we go.